Hi, my name is Jason and my two words are repetitive and renewed. To give a little bit of a background, I grew up in a church setting and I still remember when I was around eight or nine years old, um, I attended a youth church retreat where we had the opportunity to accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior. Um, and I did so at that time because I sort of knew what was going on, um, but also because the people around me did it and that's sort of just how things worked. And as I look back onto my life, this theme of how things worked really dictated um, how I did things. Um, so whether that was for school, after middle school you attend high school, after high school you go to college, or perhaps even within school, um, I would wake up, go to practice, have classes, practice, go home, do homework, sleep, and then repeat this cycle over and over. Um, and I really began to find comfort in this process due to its simplicity and safety. Um, if I did something X, then it would produce another thing Y. Um, if I didn't do X, then it wouldn't produce Y. Or even more so, if I worked harder at X, then I would have a greater yield of Y. Um, and this was continuous really until one summer three years ago where a good friend of mine asked me um, why I believed in God. Uh, taken aback by this question, I really was not able to give a sufficient answer and I was shocked because I've been going to church for around 19 years and I could not provide an answer. Um, and so this launched a rediscovery of my faith. I began to question my beliefs. Um, asking myself what I believed and why I believed it. Um, and I realized that this process that I had followed um, never really produced any kind of um, purpose in my life. And so uh, what I realized was that Jesus offers more than it just a repetitive process. Um, and he does not belong or is not contained in one part of my life. Um, and, I, and I realized no amount of church attendance or Bible reading or um, scripture memorization or even um, doing good works or being a good person could achieve the salvation of eternal life. And I was unable to do, to do this by myself. Um, you see, what Jesus offers is a personal relationship with each and one of us. Um, a relationship where it is for everybody, full of love and grace. Um, a relationship that is intimate and a relationship that renews the soul, providing purpose for our lives so that we may experience His love and a community together with Him that was created for us. So those are my two words.